Hello everybody, YouTube Legends is almost here. I'm just kidding. But guys, I have created a YouTube Legends countdown place, counting down the seconds until YouTube Legends is released. And guys, look at this. It's super insane. Look at this. Oh my God, dude. Isn't this so cool? Like, look at this. The animations are super cool and everything. And we can choose from multiple guys that we want to be. And guys, look at this. <laughs> okay, shut up. What is this? I literally just put X extra internet into my computer and now i'm getting this bullshit F you i'm just kidding there's a bunch of balls and guys look at this when we pick up the ball we can throw it around and it'll actually bounce off everything completely naturally and guys this isn't actual roblox physics either all these balls are anchored the reason they actually it looks like they're bouncing is because we actually pre-calculated where all the balls are gonna go beforehand hold on look at this hold on look at this look at this ready 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 i'm gonna show you something so insane guys did you know this is actually the letter s like i only recently noticed it but this is actually the letter s you see how it's like s like that i'm just kidding no i'm not just kidding but like i actually think we are updating our data use policy to build better tools for our creator all right let's see we are updating our data use policy we are making these updates to address the way we are processing data and the purpose of ai training to develop better tools that support your creation process i don't know what that means you think i think they just say a bunch of shit and make it say it sound hella confusing so that you just agree without knowing what you're agreeing to see like no retroactive data sharing bro you think i even know what that means let's look that up retroactive extending in scope or effect to a prior time or to conditions that existed or originated in the past what does that even mean all right guys look at this look at this when we throw the ball the path where the ball goes is predetermined so like instead of actually calculating it where it's gonna go in real time like the usual roblox physics does we calculate it beforehand because sometimes when there's physics on the server i don't know if you guys notice but sometimes the physics looks unsmooth like it doesn't look smooth and by calculating where the ball is gonna be beforehand we can play it back smoothly in sync for all the players so that all the players will see the ball moving but guys let's take a look at the actual game because that is the part that truly matters guys you know dude look at this that entire part before i just recorded the video got corrupted look at this look when i try to play it look at this we cannot open desktop this because it is corrupted like bro now i'm gonna have to freaking hack the video which is kind of annoying but i think i'll figure it out hopefully this video doesn't get corrupted but check this out we got the hype house here with all these special effects shaking and it's super dope pew, pew, pew. Oh, yo. yo what the yo what the heck but yeah there's not much else to say but the game will be out super soon make sure to check out the countdown so you're ready as soon as it releases you can play and yeah i'll see you guys later goodbye i'm just kidding